This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Volna my back here with another episode of Metal Gear Asset 2. In the last episode, we spent a good deal of time in the last room. Oh boy, longer than I expected, uh, dealing with the alarms and all such things, trying to even get this god dang sniper rifle, which is apparently right there. So, all right, let's take a look at the room before we check around. Uh, looks like there's an area you can get to. I wonder if... I wonder if that's for something to come back to later. Oh boy, that's gonna be crazy if that's the case. All right, we've got a. Uh, see, we've got one of those flying Vulcan things there that can see. Well, at least I can't see the whole place. Uh, let's see, we got one of those. Got a dude, red uh, red dude. He's got a flamethrower unit, which got he's got a uh, uh, ceramic armor or something similar to that on. Uh, so you got a shield unit with two gun auto or counters uh, so you got a patrol bot I uh, got another flamethrower unit another shielded unit another flamethrower unit God, I got quite a few of those another one over there and another shielded unit so how oh, that's reflecting how am I gonna get the uh... it kind of doesn't look like I can go just straight through it looks like I'd have to go up the ladder and around here, through there, just to get up there, around there, down to that, because I don't have, unfortunately since I don't have any of the hang, um, uh, yeah, man, too bad I don't have like a climb ability, because I could just climb up there, and then boom, just go over there, but you'd have to have climb cards, and I don't have those, because the game doesn't auto-give those to me. Well, how was I supposed to know I was going to need them? All right, well, let's let's get this started, I guess. Let's get it started now. Let's get it started in here. Let's get it started. Anyway. Unfortunately, he's going to see me, so I have to wait and see if he'll turn around or not. Mm, that's going to be fun to figure out. All right. You are not going to turn around, are you? Uh, well, I mean... That'd be a bit unfair to not. Whoops, whoops, not this. I want to do it. I mean, I don't really see anything I can affect that would. Uh, know, is that is that anything I can do too? Probably not. But I already healed myself off screen, so no, there's nothing there, no, or at least not, no cutscene occurred when I highlighted it. So. I mean, how else would you get that guy to... Uh, yeah, I probably could have done, messed with, like, equipping cards and stuff like that off screen, on screen. I mean, yeah, I can see him there. It's just not gonna... Ooh, can I... No, it's... Well, I mean, I could go up there and shoot him, but there's a chance... Well, since he's a shield unit, though, there's a high chance that maybe he might block that or something. Can't do anything with that. Just throw, just throw the bomb in there. Just save me some trouble. Yeah, probably after this mission, I'm definitely gonna have to look into maybe upgrading a lot of my cards. Trying to finally he moves. Wonder why he didn't move before. It looks like a case I probably will have to straight up, just straight up murder him. Murder? I got away with murder! Right. Um, still did that. What was that? Let's see. Hmm. Should probably. Probably see what I get on my next turn and then see if, uh. Because by shooting that one, the AK rifle, we're definitely going to cause people to, uh, um, cause people to, to explore it or figure it out. Now, I'm kind of wondering if they can actually see, like, up here. Like, some units can't do that for whatever reason, so. Hmm. 
That might miss, though. Yeah, we'll see what happens on Snake's turn. See if I can... See if he gets multiple handgun cards or whatever. Deck reload. Okay, now I see why you'd want to use, like, um, a hold off on reaction cards, because she, you know, you could have used that one card and prevented her from shooting that. And hopefully I could have killed him another way, but nope. Alright, well, I'm already getting. I'm already getting noticed by these people anyway. So. Which means if we don't want to get. Which it probably was that dude right there, so he's probably going to use his turns to come up here. We'll just have to see him wait, wait and see what he does. Okay. Let's see what happens on his turn. Because I think he would would have been the one to see it. Or... Of course, that's pretty far away. Because then he would notice. And then... Could just put him to sleep, even though he heard it. That way, well, no. He, I'm, well, I mean, I could try, but I'd probably miss. Oh, I can't see him from there? Huh. So I can see him here, but not there. Sure. Sure game. Whatever. That that makes Oh, maybe it was that dude that, that heard that the fire pit dude right there. Forgot about him. Um uh, Just kinda wanted to see wait and see what happens though. Yeah, I could move there and try to put that guy to sleep and see if uh, that way he doesn't... Of course, I'm probably going to have to kill all these guys anyway. I mean, how would I get through that room without without doing that otherwise, you know? Well, let's see what happens first before I start, like... Okay. Well... I mean, they're going to hear it anyway, so maybe I should just try to finish that guy off. Because, like I said, I'm going to have to kill all these guys anyway. At least it, it's pretty likely that's going to happen. Why even be able to finish that guy off? Because how much? He's got 200. And, well, we'll see how much damage that one does, and then we'll kind of go from there. Okay. Well, there goes that idea. Well, at least we got rid of this, uh, his, uh, armor. Which would have happened if we shot him in the front anyway. Um, or anywhere, for that matter. That did a decent amount of damage. And then... Did I get him? Oh, come on! Fine, whatever. Ooh. That shouldn't cause it... It caused the alarm to go off? Are you kidding me? That is stupid! That's not our fault, it's his fault. Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's bullshit. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I don't know, there's just something funny about the guy slipping on the wall. It's like, seems like some classic Looney Tunes shit. Uh, God, that's bullshit. Can they even see me up from up there? I guess not, because it looked like they turned to me, but nothing happened. God, fucking bullshit. Alright, whatever. You got me, game. You tricked me, apparently. Good for you. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna clear out this. Almost might be better just to what are you trying to do? So basically those those uh it almost might be better to see if I can try to kill the uh Oh, actually. I mean, 
we've already in alert territory anyway, and I need to hurt them at this point, right? So why not use the bombs and all this other stuff to to do this? Hopefully it'll let me actually shoot it from there. Yeah, okay. that. Burn, baby, burn. But yeah, might as well try to get rid of those. Apparently fire dudes cause alarms when you kill them, so might as well try to, uh, um, I mean, that's not very good. Uh, that way we'll just get the alarm reset anyway. Um, it's crazy how the ceramic armor works on the armor, too. Um, oh, he's only got two to, um, I know we're in alarm territory. Might as well use this. That's pretty good. All right. Yeah, get all that arm. Get all that out of the way. What what happens if that guy explodes? Like in that uh, that uh, uh, area? Just would he affect another? If he's coming up this way. Oh, might as well. Yeah, might as well use the bomb thing again. Why not? Now, will I be able to hit it if it's. Let's see, what's that one? It's eight? We're both going to move before that happens, though. Well, hopefully the game will let me shoot at it if it lets me throw there, but we'll find out in a second. Although, it's probably going to be like, you can't see it now. Get yeah, see it. It said I can't see it, even though I can see it, and I could throw there. Oh, man. Um, okay, so I need to get rid of... Wait, I even can't see this guy? Really? Where am I at? I can't see him? No? Seriously? I, I can't see him? Are you sure I can't see him? Uh, this is life at... He trying to think if he'll die by his next turn, but the by that point he might uh well better uh let's see if it'll actually it does oh it's not my turn right so. can I see oh no good cards um let's do that let's see if we can get some combat cards well let me nope it won't let me hit it from there crap Oh, Ray's too far away. That's. Nope, it's not gonna let me hit the. Uh... Man, damn it. All right. Guys. No, they're gonna move by the time it's a snake's turn, so. And then they're just gonna move away. As far as that guy, that guy can't see me from there. Because I can see him from there. Um. Let's try. Oh, I didn't know her turn it, uh, or her, um. Probably just gonna... Yeah, why is some fire damage do like yeah? Uh, why is some fire damage a lot more? At least that guy gets killed. Uh, like more than others, I mean. Huh? I thought. I guess in caution mode, you can't re. If you use a bomb, you can't reset it back to normal or something like that. Or something. Okay. Um. I guess I'll wait till that guy's turn goes around and see what see what happens next. Okay, yeah, that guy exploded. Does that cause the alarm to go off? Nope. Hmm. Okay. 
And everyone's gonna go reset back to normal, so on our way back this way, I guess. Alright. Yeah, we'll go. Since we don't need the life anymore, I'm gonna go and equip that card. Alright, you. That's way too far away, so. Now I don't really care about having that card anymore. I did it when the, when the, she was gonna, when uh, Venus was gonna counterattack. But so yeah, that card is useful only in very specific situations. So I can't. Oh, the only guy I can see is from there, which he's gonna get blown up eventually anyway. This is the most annoying thing about. It. Well, actually, yeah, I could probably sleep him, but we're gonna save that to when we actually. Um, get to that point. Oh yeah, that robot's probably gonna finally move now that it's, uh, now that we're actually in the area for it. I'm kind of surprised it didn't do anything during the alarm part of the, part of the mission. So it looks like those doors, we might be able to explore those maybe in another mission, but it looks like they're mainly there for the alarm situation. Um, those guys are anti. That guy's only got so much ammo or armor anyway. Probably best to go in. Oh, and that won't guarantee you kill him either. Um. Yeah, better wait for the next turn to go around. Alright. Kind of a weird, weird somber music for places like this. Not too exciting anymore. I just like, not that it needs to be. I'm just saying just in general, it's like, just has a weird feeling to it, you know? Percentage though, but that that kind of sucks. That it doesn't won't like straight up kill him though. What's there next turn? Oh, pretty soon. Uh, well, we got two chances. I could try to see if I can get lucky. Hey, we crit him. All right. Why do I have a feeling this guy's just gonna like turn around? Actually, he might go forward. I have a feeling, although I've been wrong multiple times, that maybe he'll go forward and then take his turn. So, but we'll see. He'll probably turn around and look at me just because, you know, BS or whatever. Uh, okay. uh, I'm gonna wait here and see what happens. Huh, he didn't do anything. Cool. Okay. I will take that. Yes, I shall take it downtown. Down a town. I'll just keep you as. Might be far away enough for the that one dude not to hear us. So hopefully. He it missed like, only hit three. Oh, that's stupid. Three out of the seven times. Are you kidding me? Well, look like that only hit it once. I don't think that's supposed to cause an alarm when it explodes, right? Okay. Maybe it only caused an alarm, or maybe it caused, only caused an alarm the first time because people were right next to him when he died, maybe? Like, if they're not right next to him, there's less likely of a chance to, uh, uh, for that to happen, maybe? I don't know. I'm still figuring out, like, little details about this game. All right, now, if we get up there quick, hopefully enough, I might be able to knock his ass out. Put his ass to the curb! Uh, that way I don't cause another explosion. Of course, then I'll have to deal with that guy, which I can't even get to whatever item that is. I, I wonder if there's a jump card in this game. Huh. Well, I can't put him to sleep and then, and then, sh and then kill him that way. And we'll, uh... I'll use this because I'm, I'm not a... See if that works. 
fucking missed. God damn it. Better fucking hit this time. Fuck you, game! God damn it. That's fucking bullshit. Fucking 60% at goddamn point blank range. Fuck you. Piece of garbage. That's bullshit. I don't even have any good combat cards at this point. Yeah, that's fucking bullshit. Like, odds are I should have hit that guy. And still no cards? Come on, man. If I get oh, and if I get too close to him, I'm gonna freaking get hit by the explosion. Ugh. Fuck. Did I not? Well, no. If I if I punch him manually, I think they automatically turn to you though. Although I already got I already created an alert, so it's not like it's gonna change anything, right? Whoa. Huh. Well, well there you go. Huh. Did not ex Actually, I did not expect that to happen, frankly. That was a surprise. Thanks. I won't be able to get that card pack, though. I mean... Alright. Well, at least some things are coming up Millhouse, I guess. Alright, now he can see... He can see those two spots. I don't know if he's going to move at any point. I assume he's going to, because that would be kind of unfair that he can't, like, somehow stealth this part, but... Might be better just to try and... Wait, what's his life at? 80? Oof. Probably not going to be able to hit it with this. Oh, the percentage is so crappy, though. Although, even if the percentage were higher, I bet with my luck, I would still miss anyway. You're going to be out for a few minutes. Uh-oh. You gonna? Did you turn to me? No. Well, let's see. What do we? Oh, those odds are crappy. Look at that. And I can't. And I can't move much closer. It's. I mean. Well, with that, that probably wouldn't be even a better position anyway. Let's see. Mm. Yeah, they ain't really. They ain't really making it a better spot. Good lord. I need some help from uh, Miss uh, Miss Lady over here, if you can help me. If you can help me, raise your hands and say you're sorry. Oh my god, those percentages suck. This game just does not want me to do this easily, does it? Um... No, those aren't the same. Well. Let's see, he goes on two. Man. Um, I was thinking about almost moving on, and then just trying to see if I could if I could do enough, even though I'm alerted, maybe still get enough damage off on him. Yeah, let's do it. What? Oh, it's auto. God damn it. Fuck off. Fuck off. Bullshit. Now, of course, I miss ha most, of the, most of the shots. Of course, I do. I don't know why I thought... For some reason, I thought they were, like... They took a few seconds to go before an alarm, but nope. Nope. Uh, screwed. I'm screwed again. Uh, should I wait for a turn to go, I guess? Or I'm gonna wait for more, for more action cards. Uh, man. Well, I got rid of most of the, most of the. No, no I was gonna wait there. At least I got rid of most of the uh, other dudes. So. Uh, he's in the fucking way. God damn it. Oh, fuck you. That's bullshit. And I, I assume I can't, like, just, uh... Um... Oh, I was gonna... Ah, uh, fuck! Ah, uh, damn it! I was gonna, uh... Um... Use the punch card on him. No. 
What's that? Actually, it looks like knockdown makes you use a card or something like that, I noticed. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, I killed him! Oh, I need to move out of the way before, uh, before another one appears. Aw, oh, damn it! No, he's gonna. Ah, oh, fucking. Oh, shit. Damn it! That blows. Like, blows like hard. Damn it. Oh, alright. I'm just gonna try to do it on my turn. So you're gonna try and go all the way back. card you got rid of, but, oops, actually, yeah, we're going to do that, okay, there we go, okay, I'm going to try to, and then move, so I can, maybe not get immediately seen, oh no, snake, snake got knocked out, are you kidding me, oh. all right, great, thanks, I think you got. I think it's because of. I guess the combination of damage from before. So, all right, whatever. All right, do that. Now then we're gonna move. Oh, okay, good. I'll check inside, Snake. Back me up, okay? <laughs> Just picked it up. I guess we ought to pick up whatever card sets there, too. And boob jiggle. Here it is, the PSG-1. Well done! Wait a minute. What's wrong? There's no ammunition. God damn it. <laughs> Without ammo, it's worthless. Yeah, tell it. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> there must be somewhere some stashed around here somewhere. Great, now we got another place to check. What do you mean, somewhere? Maybe upstairs. Worth a shot! Get upstairs and search for another PSG-1! Roger. Oh, good. Well, at least that's the end of the mission, huh? God, that was another long episode. Woo! I should have expected that at some point I couldn't keep the 22 minute, uh, 22 minutes going forever. That's the aim, silence, that's another... Oh, that's equip. Oh, that's... Oh, that's kind of similar to... Well, not exactly. I'm hoping at one point maybe we'll get access to the, uh, invisibility... A, uh, item that was in the first game, but oh, Gary, there's Gary from the previous game. Uh, uh, Metal Gear Acid One, the guy who pretended to be your friend and ended up being like one of the main villains. You know, typical twist and all that. For those, sorry, spoilers for the first game. Ooh, handgun. That one looks like it does decent amount of damage at high percentage. And the PTRS 1941. Ooh, 300 attack at 75 percent, but one shot. Yes, yeah, so if you miss. Well, screw you. Uh, oh, Idea Spy 2.5. I think that's not Police Knots, but somewhere around that similar line, I think. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got multiple cards. Okay. We got that other rifle, or rifle, and then we got this one, too. This one's the official one. So, but we can't use it until we have ammo, which basically means we need another card because it's an equip card. So, all right. Oh, we're. Well, mission's complete, but we're still still going on with the story, so this episode might last a little longer than I expected. Uh-oh. This is... Okay. What in the name of... Metal Gear! I mean, sorry. Metal Gear? Metal Gear? But it looks different from the one we saw. This one isn't Co Complethorn's work. It was salvaged from Libido Island. After an incident that took place there. Lobito Island. I don't... Lobito Island? I don't even know what that's from. You don't remember, do you? Yeah, I, I have amnesia. Jerk. Dot, dot, dot. Just relax. This one's only being held for research purposes. And if you say so. It doesn't pose any threat, so keep moving. If we were playing Mel, your solid snake, he would destroy this even if even if it was just for research purposes because he, he straight out hated Metal Gears at that point. Or at least he made his life's work to get rid of Metal Gears. Oh no, that mentioning of a Metal Gear won't come back at any point in the game. Nope. Not at all. Uh-uh. 
Not gonna happen. But anyway, it looks like there is a, another remnant of another Metal Gear, but until we can use the sniper rifle to get past the goddamn bridge, we're gonna have to get some more ammo, which obviously is not in the same spot as the weapon. Anyway, in the next episode of Metal Gear Acid 2, we'll try to find some ammo for this puppy. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.